So growing up in the Rogue Valley, we don't expect to see high-tech jobs, and so we don't look for them. It's surprising how many people don't realize how many tech jobs there actually are in Southern Oregon. People think they can't make money in Southern Oregon. Uh, they feel like they need to um, drive north or go down to Silicon Valley to make money. Um, and that's totally an incorrect perception. So at first glance, you would look at Southern Oregon as a really small niche group of industries and have no idea that there's so much need for tech workers here. There are a lot of amazing tech opportunities here, uh, Zeal being one of them, but I can literally look and I just looked past four or five opportunities within a one block radius in tech. Southern Oregon is quite frankly an emerging technology area. There's a lot of pockets of small companies doing amazing things in this valley. There are many companies that are committed to expanding their use of their technology in their businesses. If you're in a market like Portland or Seattle or San Francisco, very attractive, but a very high cost of living, and also many more people competing for those jobs. Come to a business with an idea of how you can apply technology to help them, they'll be listening. In Southern Oregon, many opportunities await motivated and skilled job seekers. There are numerous resources available to help guide and prepare people entering and transitioning into the workforce. Here at Workforce Rogue Valley, what we do is help skill people up to meet the needs of the community and the jobs that are out there and help people tailor their skills, their resume, their cover letter, their application to that specific job that they're applying for. A traditional computer science department in higher education is for programmers that are they're learning C++ or other programming languages. We go beyond that. We include that, but we go beyond that and we offer graphic design tier degrees. We offer an emerging media technology transfer to Southern Oregon University. We have programming degrees to both Oregon Tech and Crown Falls and Southern Oregon University Nashland. We have two-year healthcare informatics helping students work in the hospital or medical field with computers. And we have a what I call computer support technician where they work with help desk or basic networking for any company in our community. Now we will hear directly from the companies that are always seeking ambitious and driven team members, offering some insight on how to succeed. If you're coming right out of college, it's really important that you have had some form of work experience besides proof of concepts within school, but also being at a, a local technology company as an intern if need be, but getting the experience in the real life hands-on experience makes a, a large difference. I would say people who are in the tech industry or kind of want to break into it, the best thing to do is to really get out there and talk to people and be willing to share ideas and work on projects to really network yourself within the community. I would say just being familiar with current technologies, uh, whether uh, if, you're, if you're a programmer, you know, be familiar with what companies are using today. It might be PHP or Python. Be current on technology. Um, have some experience doing something rather recently, I think is important. We're looking for people that are really hungry. They have a great capacity to learn. Uh, and of course, that they want to be doing what they're doing. And you can kind of say that it ultimately boils down to personality traits that you're looking for. Um, but that ultimately is what it becomes about. Expertise in our world is not just about the ability to write the code. It's about being able to build the right product the right way. And a lot of that dynamic is how we work together. The education's great, and getting that under your belt gives a solid foundation. But the thing that differentiates you is how hard you're willing to work to hone your craft. How hard are you willing to work to get really good at what you do. And it's so exciting right now. I mean, we're changing the world. Tech companies in Southern Oregon are aware of the benefits of having a fun, productive, and healthy work environment. They take pride in providing awesome workspaces. It's important to us, just as a company, that we have employees who go home and they feel they've had a, a rewarding work day, they've accomplished what they needed to in their jobs, but they've also accomplished some of their own needs with 
working out or taking care of themselves and then they can focus on on their family and what they like to do outside of work. We don't want employees working so much that they never get to enjoy life. I call it full circle wellness. Like we have a a really robust wellness program that goes from, you know, massage, yoga, meditation to fitness classes and wellness is feeling good about your life. And people can bring their dogs to work. You know, there's a daycare so they can see their kids in the middle of the day. It's about approaching and, and being with our employees, I guess, in all facets. I think that those opportunities not only help people deal with any work challenges or working as a team, but any stress that come up or understanding family events. Uh, it's not uncommon to see you know, family members at the, the company socials that happen monthly. It's highly encouraged for family members to come to, come to events. It's literally the recognition that you can't separate family and work. And rather than try to fight that, to synergize that, and to make that a better whole for the individual, their families, and the company. We are really lucky in that we really come together. We do fun Fridays, so every week we have lunches together. It's kind of a smaller office, so it's actually a lot easier to get together and do things. Um, we're super into ping pong these days. We changed our conference room into a ping pong room, so we're able to play games together. And we've done um, local competitions with our ping pong tournament, playing like a local coffee company. So it's just really fun to kind of come together and get this fun competition. We've even had some um, decisions about how something should look on the website be um, decided on the ping pong table through a match. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I won. <laughs> Southern Oregon is filled with opportunity, resources, and culture. The tech industry is growing, and with the right attitude, skills, and drive, you can find a position working for one of the many progressive and expanding companies in the area.